Numbers of deadly car crashes make a huge leap, and the reason may be right in the palm of your hand. WJZ is live. Devin Bartolotta explains how the distracted driving issue is changing. Devin? Well, the fight for years has been against texting and driving, but smartphones are now upping the ante when it comes to distractions behind the wheel. A crisis on America's roads. Fatal crash numbers through the roof. More than 35,000 people killed on America's roadways in 2015. Compared to about 32,000 in 2014, it's the biggest jump in nearly 50 years. If you need to text, wait till you get to a safe spot. The MVA blames smartphones. We're using texting, we're, we're using apps, we're doing all kinds of things with these devices, but really you need to park that phone before you drive. Don't even let it be a distraction. From 2014 to 2015, deadly crashes caused by a distracted driver rose nearly 9%. And it's not just using GPS. It's everything from browsing social media to playing games, even using Snapchat. In this video, a 22-year-old driver using Snapchat clocked his car at 82, then 115 miles per hour. Moments later, he crashed, killing five people. Maryland drivers aren't having it. These days, mostly with young kids and Facebook and Twitter, everyone is trying to get updates at every second. I just think it's rude because you're just putting so many people in danger. A clear choice for drivers who don't want to become a statistic. It can wait. Maryland is trying something kind of unique to combat this problem. Earlier this year, MVA designated 13 safe texting zones at rest stops throughout the state. Reporting live tonight, I'm Devin Bartolotta, WJZ Eyewitness News. All right, Devin, thanks. Back in September, Governor Larry Hogan announced a $12.5 million grant to crack down on distracted and reckless driving here in Maryland.